Good evening and welcome back. Yes, there is an exciting day here planned. I am here this morning for the grand opening of Gideon's Bakehouse at Disney Springs. If you're not aware what Gideon's Bakehouse is, it's a cookie store uh, from Orlando that eventually they did come to Disney Springs. They had a soft opening a while ago. I was not able to make it to the soft opening. So I'm here for the grand opening. I hear they're gonna have lots of festivities, a lot of things going on. So it should be pretty exciting. I'm pretty excited. I'm gonna get a couple of the limited edition cookies that they're gonna have only today and try it on the video. And we'll see what other festivities they have. And yes, it should be a great day. I'm here early, so I guess we'll see. So I knew that the parking decks would be pretty hard to get a hold, get into. So I took an Uber to the Hilton Hotel and there's a walkway from the Hilton Hotel to Disney Springs. So on this walkway, you come to the end. There's a little sign here stopping you from going in yet. I heard Orange Garage is opening at 9 a.m. They usually open at 10. So I think they're gonna let us in at 9 a.m. as well. So uh, we'll, look, we'll hopefully we'll get in at 9. They're giving away free um, prints, free um, art, artistic prints and stickers and thanks to the first, uh, I think, thousand guests, I think. So it should be pretty exciting. That building right there is the Bippity Boppity Boutique. They're currently closed due to COVID. Right next to it is what used to be The Void, which was a VR experience. They had like Star Wars, where you put on a VR headset and you like go around and uh, fight and everything. And I didn't go to that, I really wanted to, but um, every time I wanted to, something came up, so. I'm very disappointed I didn't get, that, get to go on that. Right next to that is the toy store. Uh, I remember fond memories of when the toy store used to be like, there's always used to be one building, and that toy store used to be huge. And as a child, going through there, it was always such a beautiful sight. Here we go. Right here we go. It's kind of funny, people are just running from all directions. Almost there. It's right next to Morimoto Asia, around Boathouse. If you're not aware of where it's going to be, I know it's a little difficult to find. Here we go, small line. This is very exciting. It's right up there at the end of the line. That's where Gideon's is. How are you? Good morning. Good morning. Wow. People really like their cookies. That's for sure. I'm not sure when they're actually opening their doors. But it should be soon. They're coming with the menus to give them out and show people what they're serving this morning. So here's their menu. This is the um, basic January menu, not including all the exclusives they're having. I was, so um, they're gonna have original chocolate chip, peanut butter crunch, pistachio toffee, cookies and cream, and triple chocolate. But they're going to have special edition cookies all month, and those are the um, coffee toffee chocolate chip. And if you come in the morning, you can get the coffee cake cookie, which is a morning exclusive. And they also have cake slices, nitro cold brew, and other beverages that you can choose from. So um, pretty good menu here, but they're gonna have more too inside, so. So the menu is very um, exciting, as you see. There's a portrait here of this guy, um, and on the back. This is extremely busy, wow. Right across the street, we have Mr. Raglan Road sitting there with his hat on his bench. It appears as if he, he's kind of disappointed, perhaps with the long line. All right, the time's currently 9.29, so just as I predicted, they're letting people in already, so should probably be not very long until we get in, uh, try some cookies. So usually when they have the normal virtual queue going, or when lines are too long, which I'm thinking they're gonna do at some point today, is they have a virtual queue, which means uh, you come here, you give them your phone number, and they text you when it's time to come back, when um, it's your time to come in line, and there's a short line here, you wait, and then you go in. Um, sometimes I've heard it even goes for four hours long. That's the rumor I'm hearing. 
So um, this is where you'd return if you did. Time coming out here? Um, I actually came a little bit earlier, but I'm here to check out all the new things today. So, yeah. So you, were you here during our soft opening? Um, the period between the right, couple the days ago. Tiny, yeah, yeah, <laughs> the, yeah. The little build up yeah, to the, the grand opening. Yeah, so the, we just kind of remembered how to do this thing. Halfway soft, halfway yeah. hard. So. Well, I appreciate you coming out. Yeah, appreciate if that. If you have any questions about what you need on the inside, I'm fluid. I'm Sounds good. Thank you. <laughs> that was Steve, the main cookie man here, and uh, he just the like, queue now is five and a half hours right now. So I guess I came right on time. And um, yeah, I guess pretty lucky for that. Hopefully we'll get in very soon and should be good. All right, great, thank you. Enjoy. Oh, sorry, thank you. So as you can see, the theming in here is incredible. It's supposed to be like a haunted library or something. So they have a lot of theming here. It smells really good. They have a lot of exclusive cookies here today too. And they're giving away free art prints and a sticker. So here's the menu. All cookies are $6. All cake slices are $9. The limited cookies are $6. Gideon's Bites are $20. $10 with a hot cookie with ice cream. And they also have drinks too. They have um, nitro brew coffee for $6. They have peanut butter iced coffee, ginger snap cold brew, classic white cold brew, and milk. If you want milk, it's just $2.97. And they also have a soda shop with Blue Sky, Coca Cola, and Dasani water. Small is $2.50, a large is $3.50. So what are the, I like this little fire effect right here. Sounds good. <laughs> I just don't want to forget anything. All right, so we just got out of Gideon's. There's a, um, that was a great experience. I didn't even know they were selling masks. That's a really, I'm very happy about that. I like their masks a lot. And um, I got my print, my sticker and everything. I got um, a good amount of the limited edition cookies, so I'll try those, see how they are. All right, so here I am. I just got out of Gideon's. I have my cookies here, and I'm gonna show you everything I got. I should probably keep this on for now until I start eating. But let's start off with the fun things they gave. Here is a sticker right here. We also have this art print here, which is limited edition, numbered. I'm um, pretty excited to see how this looks. All right, here we go. Wow, look at that. So my number is 196 out of 1,000, so there's only 1,000. Wow, I bought this. I didn't know they had these, so I'm very happy I saw, found this. They had masks. So I have a Gideon's mask here. I'm gonna try it on right now, actually. All right, so here's the mask. Oh, this is nice. <laughs> yeah, I like this a lot. This box is really heavy. Here's the white Christmas. Let's eat that one first. I heard some good things about this during Christmas time. I'm gonna eat half of it so I can, because I don't want to eat three huge cookies right now, so. Here, here it is. It's white chocolate, it has like sugar on top. It looks really good. There's the inside, there's a cross section for you there. And you have to yell at me, try and see how it is. Gosh, that's really good. I'm, I'm gonna be honest with you right now. I really do not like white chocolate cookies. But this has to be my favorite one I've tried so far. So this is incredible. It's not like too white chocolatey. It's just, it's very good. Gosh, wow, that's good. Here's the next one I'm gonna try. The Frankenstein. It's like chocolatey with M&Ms. Also, I'm gonna split this one in half as well. 
won't be the last. I don't want it to be gone in five seconds. So let me try this. Um, here's a cross section of it. See how it is inside. Very good. Yeah, I really like this. This it really. Um, I usually like M&M &M cookies a lot. As usual, the cookie is very good. It's a Gideon's cookie, first of all. And then you have this, um, like little, um, like Oreos a little bit, and I think too, and M&Ms. So it's really good. As you can see, the inside isn't full um, like chocolate. So it's like a normal cookie with like a coating of like Oreo crumbles on the outside. I like the white Christmas more, but this is as very good as well. So. So the last one is a peanut butter swirl, as seen right here. It's chocolate and peanut butter. I'm not a big chocolate and peanut butter person either, but I'm very hopeful because the white Christmas was amazing. So, yeah, let's try. Wow, that's really good. It's good. I mean, as I said, I don't really like. Um, you have to have a good ratio of chocolate peanut butter to make it really good. I feel like this kind of has it, but um, I don't know. I, I would definitely rank it the least out of all three of these, but I still think it's a decent, really good cookie. So, it's a nice little box here. Here's the cookies. I got some um, red velvet cake to try later. And yes, I will post a review on that. And don't forget, if I did promise a um, review on the other Everglaze donuts, that is coming. Don't worry, don't fret, it's coming, it'll come eventually. It's just that I've had a lot going on, so I haven't gotten to um, get that up yet. Really great experience at Gideon's today. The grand opening, celebrated very nicely with these cookies. Um, yeah, it was a great day here, uh, nice morning, and I was really lucky to um, get in there because I think the line's now like seven hours, I, I believe, I don't know, I heard that. Yeah, it was, it was really good, um, probably, I, I tried the original cookie before I didn't uh, film it, but it was really good. They just have really great quality cookies. Probably the best ones you'll ever get in this area of Florida. Um, in my opinion, probably the best cookies I've ever had. So yeah, so pretty good place. I recommend you come there and get a mask, get a cookie, whatever you want. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe to the um, channel where I can review the cake later. So thank you for watching and I hope you have a fine day.